Y'all ready, y'all ready, y'all ready, y'all ready. Hey, it's me, Shireen, aka Absalon Smiley, and today we're talking about my curls and my curly hair routine. If you like what you see, please keep watching. We're gonna try to not flash you my curly hair routine. So it's not really anything special. This is probably like my only requested video. I think it's just because I rock my hair curly more often now. I basically only rock my hair curly. I've tried doing this a few times and I failed, um, but now we're gonna try. I'm gonna be honest, I'm super cheap, and so I just can't throw stuff away and i have like shampoo and conditioner that i got for free i feel like it's just so much research to figure out the right shampoo and conditioner so if you know something please let me know i mean it's just like hair product everything just takes a lot of research it takes time to try things out so let me know i know i should probably use it, be using like sulfate free and all that stuff but I just don't know what to buy, so let me know. Anyway, so I wash my hair. I usually honestly just concentrate on my scalp and then let it kind of drip down to the ends. And then I conditioned my hair and I basically didn't even wash any of it out. And then I typically do this in the shower. So I don't let my hair dry at all. I'll like squeeze it out in the shower, but then I always have um, my curl mix soften. Ooh, there's hair all over the soften, it's the flaxseed gel, the soften one. And I just use basically like two pumps on each side. And I just like scrunch it in. That's it. It's so easy. And this bottle is about to be done. Gotta get more. So two of these bottles have lasted me since August. So like eight or nine months. And so like each bottle will last me about like four months. You guys might have seen if you watch Shark Tank. Oh my gosh, this is like literally about to be done. Y'all are about to see what I do. I mean, I think everyone does this, but I like cut my bottles. <laughs> this is not how I planned to do this. Don't dry your hair. Do it in the shower. It's just easier. Yeah, it's just like you get out and then it's done. My goodness. This is not what I wanted to do on my curly hair routine video. So I don't like losing a lot of product. I like when my hair looks soft. That should be enough. So I just let it air dry. If you can air dry it to basically 90%, then I think your hair looks best. I don't wash all my conditioner out because basically like a leave-in conditioner. So I leave it in. <laughs> And then um, I feel like that helps with moisture. And then the other reason why you don't want to dry your hair is because these products like react to water. And then when you have like some dry pieces, that's how it gets frizzy. And your hair is just like inconsistently um, dry. And so your hair just doesn't look good because the product is like touching wet hair and dry hair. I dry my hair air dried as long as I can, usually like an hour to an hour and a half, but sometimes you don't have that kind of time. So we might need to diffuse because I need to leave in a little bit. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Um, air dried for about like 45 minutes. It's a little bit wet. If it was cold outside, I definitely wouldn't go outside, but it's kind of nice out. But I still want to show you guys how I uh, diffuse my hair. And I diffuse my hair because I feel like it helps with volume. And then obviously it dries it. And then it kind of like breaks up the curls. So I'm going to show you what I do. So I have a Baby Bliss um, blow dryer. I've had this for a few years. It's, it's real good. And then I have this like collapsible diffuser, which I don't love. But it's easy for traveling. And so basically I usually put it at warm, not hot, and at low. And I basically just diffuse my hair and just like cup the hair in the diffuser, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna show you. So sometimes I'll like flip it and get in there and I'll like flip it to the side. So when it flips over, there's like good volume on the side since I part my hair in the middle now. too much because that's how it causes frizz but you know I'm kind of in a rush so I don't got time for this which is like the reality of a lot of us right Ooh, I'm feeling this maybe I'll go to a side part again ready to see what it looks like okay 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 looks pretty good looks pretty good 
so I feel like this is pretty much how I like my hair to look. I like it to look big. I like my curls to look popping. But then, like, you know, like when it dries a little bit more, it'll be like more softer looking. So, yeah. So I think a lot about curly hair is just like having confidence in it and then trying things out. So and like a lot of people are like, oh, I have curly hair, but I never rock curly because it never looks good. And I think it's really about like trying different products and being okay with your hair not looking perfect. Because you can't really manipulate curly hair. Like, I mean, I guess you could put a curling iron to it, but I don't really like that look. Some people do a really good job at it. But like, when you blow dry your hair, when you straighten your hair, you can make it look perfect. And my hair barely ever looks perfect, but I just like rock it. I'm like, this is my hair. It's probably a little frizzy. Um, you know, my curls aren't perfect, but it's what I got. And it's it's honestly the easiest way to rock my hair. I truly feel like everyone looks best with their natural hair. So if you got natural curly hair, you should try curl mix and you should try not washing your hair as often and try leaving conditioner in your hair and just rocking your curls because curls are beautiful. Like, tell me. How you gonna tell me curls are not beautiful? It's all about just like rocking your hair and just like killing it. Honestly, I feel like it's just all about confidence. I hope you guys like my video. I am not a beauty guru, so I will not be doing more videos like this. Honestly, like you guys, I'll show you some of my thumbnails that are just like epic fails. I'm not good at posing. I'm trying to get better at it because I feel like that's a good quality to have just so you like your pictures. Because a lot of times I'm like, ew, ew. I don't like pictures very much, but I, I do believe in, you know, sharing knowledge. Um, I feel like rocking your hair curly is so much easier, y'all. So you should try it. Thank you so much for watching. I took a week off from the Upside Down Smiley Show, but if you are interested in being on my show, please let me know. I like having guests here with me. Let's talk about random things.